I would like to tell all my friends and my juniors that Guru Channel is doing fabulous job. Like they are uh, taking a topless interview, making videos for aspirants, and also posting um, agriculture related current affairs. So follow this channel and subscribe this channel and stay updated. <laughs>
glimpses of post harvest technology but in kumar in kumar and glimpses both are not necessary if you have time enough time then then you then you can read this book but if you don't have enough time then uh, you may skip it and you may only read those uh, main books like hb cluster sessions etc okay and also you need to you need to uh, practice mcq books also like there are lots of mcq books in the market uh, had a mission of article section of article there as yet you need to practice those books okay and how and how did you get and it notes so well um, everybody has their own study strategy like what i did i used to collect extra informations extra points from different books online pdfs and um, i used to write down them in my notebook and my main book man which i followed mainly and i used to make some tables flow charts for uh, so that i can remember easily yeah that's all how to handle your main exam how many question you are untapped and uh, what is your score uh, so what i did in the main exam i attend in past round i attended all those questions on which i was confident like 100% sure and this round should be completed within 1 hour okay but you you can you may take 15 minutes extra extra and in say, uh, second round we should attend uh, those quest- those questions on which we there is a chance of 50% correcting okay in second round we have to take some risk and in third round and uh, this round is more risky if you see that you have attended already uh, more than 100 questions then you can leave this round but if you say that you have attended very less amount of question then you have to take that risk mm. but one main thing i would like to say that before attending any question just read the question carefully and take 5 to 10 seconds to think properly um, to make your option to make your answer correct and how to avoid negative marking yeah i i as i said earlier that in third round we should not take uh, so much risk uh, if i have already attended more than 100 questions um, only attend those questions uh, where there is a chance of uh, 50% correcting the where there you can eliminate at least two options you should attend only that type of questions not more than that okay and how did you revise in the last 10 days actually i did nothing special in last 10 to 15 days i tried to revise whole syllabus in last days where i and i emphasized on those portion where i was weak that's all and i practiced mcqs a lot in last uh, last few days and how did you keep yourself motivated i know students get frustrated during this journey because syllabus is so hard and so fast and hard to remember so that is okay that is completely okay but i one thing i just want to say that um don't lose your hope sometimes you may get lower marks in your test series in your mock test but that time you don't need to worry about that just uh, just find out where you are making mistakes and learn from it and move on and one more thing that i would uh, like to say that uh, first fix your mind that why you are giving this exam and then build confidence in yourself that you can do that and uh, try hard give your best give your 100% and rest will happen automatically okay and my next question is why did you choose horticulture subject for jrf exam okay well i did my uh, bsc in horticulture so i found interest in these subjects like veg fruits floriculture so that's why i chose it for my career for my future but that is not necessary to uh, follow others you just see that uh, on which subject you are getting interest while reading choose that subject it may be agronomy it may be um, entomology or plant science okay that's all 
एंड व्हाट इज योर फ्यूचर प्लान एंड व्हाट स्कोप इन हॉर्टिकल्चर स्कोप देन वेल यू नो दैट देयर आर सेवरल जॉब्स इन गवर्नमेंट सेक्टर्स एंड इन प्राइवेट सेक्टर्स एज वेल in private sectors there are uh, in private sectors uh, like uh, food uh, food processing companies at their uh, fertilizers companies seed production companies at their and people are getting good amount of package and in india as we know that uh, important scope of horticulture is increasing day by day so we don't need to worry about that and apart from that there is a wonderful opportunity of being scientist here through srf ids and all so that's all my uh, my also future plan is doing phd after msc through srf okay apart from these are questions any remains please tell about uh, anything important thing upcoming juniors so i think um i feel that nothing is left i have shared all my strategies and um just one thing i want to i would like to add that just keep believe in yourself study hard and you will also get the good rank you will also be selected in good university best of luck for your future okay But now finally i would like to tell all my friends and my juniors that guru channel is doing fabulous job like they are uh, taking a topus interview making videos for aspirants and also posting um, uh, agriculture related current affairs so follow this channel and subscribe this channel and uh, stay updated okay thank you so much for giving me interview and your valuable time thank you so much